This is Professor Capco. Welcome to another video. This one is about how to create a mind map in Microsoft Word. I'm just going to briefly show you how you could create a mind map using Microsoft Word. It's very simple. You just open Word and you want to show various shapes and then write in them. So you could go to the insert and you could select shapes would be one way to do it. And let's say I want to select a rectangle. Just place the rectangle where you want to place it. And you could do a background color or no background color. Let's do a background color just to make it colorful. And then we can type in there shape one and click off of it. Let's place another one. Let's insert another shape. Let's do kind of an oval. Let's put this one over here. You can change it to be wider or narrower. Let's do it wider. Click off of it. I'm going to click inside of it. Shape 2. In this one, let's have a different background color, like that. And then let's do one third one, just to show you. Insert. We can do another shape. Uh, let's do a triangle, just for the heck of it. And let's say we want to make it very wide, like this. And let's have no background color on it. And I could do shape 3 here. Now, let's show how they're connected. We can do that by inserting a line. And I just connect the line like that from one to the other. I can make that line a different color. And I could make it a different uh, color like this would be another way to do it. You can change it around like that. And let's do one more line. Again, to shapes. And again, this is just a very simple way of doing it. There are other methods, and we could make this more complex. I'm just showing you a very simple, quick, and easy way to do this. And let's, let's change it around. Let's make this a yellow line. Again, the colors don't particularly matter. I just wanted to show you the process for creating the mind map in Word. If you have any questions, you can post them in the comment section. I would really appreciate it if you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to keep your grade alive. Thank you again. This is Professor Capco.